Good morning, good morning, guys. No, good morning. It's afternoon. Good afternoon, guys. <laughs> so we're still locked down. So um, I think until the 14th of June. Yeah. Uh, we're probably gonna be locked down a little bit more than that, I reckon, because cases still, 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 still very still, high. Still, still high, but so <laughs> because we cannot go anywhere, we decided that we're gonna show you today how to make. Gula Malacca. It's a Malaysian dessert. Come with the brown sugar, the filling, and the coconut outside. So you're gonna see so. it's very, very yummy. So Fisa is gonna show you what we got inside. So let us know. You're the cook. Look, that's inside. I will start with the, the ingredients and all of that. Okay. All right. This is a brown. Sorry, it's a palm sugar. It's very hot, show it. Yeah, it's really hot. If you are in Europe, you can find in Asian market. And this is a glutinous rice flour. Where is it written in English? Over here. Yeah, glutinous rice flour. Yeah. Here. And a little bit pandan nose leaf. Smell good. And a little bit of uh, coconut. It's supposed to be a fresh coconut, but I went to village grocer in the market, but they are of fresh coconut. I mean, great coconut, sorry. <laughs> great coconut. So I just have a dry one. Dry, yeah. So this one can be used to. Yeah, well, how's the a little bit of flour. Normal flour. Yeah, that's it. All right. So let's start it. What is the first step? We're going to cut the pandan leaf. Mm -hmm. Follow me, follow me. I'm not going anywhere. So I'm going to cut chang chang. Okay, that's it. And you put a bit water. That mash might okay. Yeah. So I'm going to blend. While she's blend the, the stuff over there, I just remind you that every Sunday I'm going to post a video to help you becoming a digital nomad. So if you do not want to miss any of these videos, it's going to be a 12 video series. Do not forget to subscribe and to hit the notification bell. You finished? Yes. Yeah. Okay, we're going to drain the banana sleeve here. We just took, take the water, sorry. You okay. just keep the water. Yeah, that's it. So not much, no. Yeah, I'm, I'm not making 50 pieces. Just a little one. That's enough. Okay. Uh, you have a busy buddy over there. Hello, guys. Let's go with you. Hey! Now, go down. Go down. Go down. 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 It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. mommy, son. Yeah, daddy, okay. sit down. I just, I just walk on him. So, this is how the bananas water. So, I'm going to get some salt. Pink salt? Any salt, doesn't matter. Just a little bit, okay? That's it. Okay, and a big water. Very little. Right That's it. And again, add glutinous flour. How many grams? Roughly? Uh, maybe one cup. Let's see. 
later on I'm gonna put the, um, the recipe on our website so you will be able to click on the description below and you will be able to see the website with all the, the measurements okay. So we put one spoon of uh, normal flour. Okay. He wants the pandan leaf, I think. Ah, oh, yes, actually. He likes to bite the pandan leaf. So I'm just not I add here. You can see how is it. I'm gonna have the hair everywhere. Ah, yay! Ooh, very naughty cat. Not naughty. My king. So you just stir it. Stir it. A little more. And a little bit of color. That's a bit. What is that? Color. Ah, color. Green. Green color. Yes. To make it the colors nicer. Mm, nice smell actually. Can you smell guys? Can you smell? Of course you can. If you can smell, you comment below. I don't think you can. Of course you can. Okay, you see. And then you need to put more of flour. I mean, still. Consistency, yeah? Not too soft, not too hard. Mm. Normally, um, people selling this quite expensive. How much I mean, normally cost they sell it? Like by six, yeah? Six pieces, like three, four ringgit, four ringgit. So four ringgit is roughly a um, dollar. But it's really, really tiny. Yeah, very small. little one. Yeah. But for Malaysian, I think that's pretty expensive. For Malaysian, pretty expensive. Like six pieces for one dollar. Four ringgit fifteen is one dollar. So it's almost. So a bit more of it. So you can see. Until it become too soft, let me. Okay, oh no, it's too soft still. Is it not sticky, right? It's going to be sticky, yeah. but not to stick in your hand. So, if it's not stick in your hand, so mean the dough is fine. This is very famous Malaysian breakfast. That's a Malaysian dessert too. I mean, Malay, we say sedap sedap. Malay, sedap sedap. Which means? Do you like it? Which means? But means sedap. Delicious, la. Delicious, of course I like it. You should learn how to make this. Yeah, I'm learning now. I'm gonna watch the YouTube video later and I'm gonna make it myself. Really? Yeah. I don't think so. <laughs> I have a Malay wife that made it for me. Why should I do it? <laughs> ah, see? Ha ha. Ha ha. You have another busy body behind. What is it? This is our the new member of our family. We just pick her up on the street the other day. And um, Fiza wanted to give it back. We wanted to rehome the, the cat. And we found someone to rehome the cat, but Fiza was crying and uh, she didn't want to give her back at the end, so we kept it. And now we have three cats. And, uh, and this is the last one. No more. Yeah, no more. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's ready. It's ready. You can see it's not stick to my hand. Yeah, that's good. You can make a ball. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> this is only one, yeah? Huh? Only one. Only one. <laughs> How many can you make with this? I'm not so sure. Maybe 30 pieces. Quite a lot actually for yeah. this. Okay. So what do we do next? Yeah. I'll stick my hand. So I'm going to cut the 
palm of sugar. Mm -hmm. Tiny, tiny, yeah, tiny chunk. Chunk, chunk. Okay. You can see how hard it is. It's really hard. I normally keep them in the in the freezer, but when to use, you have to leave it outside only for one two hours. And easy to cut. Otherwise, you think it's easy to find anywhere? Yes. I think yeah, you can find. In Asian market, you can find, but in Malaysia, you can find everywhere. Yeah. Because this is. Uh, how much does, does it cost this from? in Malaysia? Five ringgit. It's like. For how many grams? I'm not so sure. They have like one stick like that. Pretty cheap actually. Actually, the palm sugar comes from Malacca. Mm. From the south. Fill this brown sugar into the into this one. Yeah. Okay. Let's start first. Let me show you. How does it look? Oh, just take okay. a little bit. What we have to do is uh, I already fill up water here. Mm -hmm. And then? Then, until the water boil, so we can dip into it. Into it. And when the gula malaka floating, so meat is ready. Alright, let's do a few of them first so we can yeah, see. But we have to wait at least another 5 minutes. Alright, so we're gonna see you in 5 minutes guys. See you soon. Alright, we are back. The water uh, is almost ready. You can start to see some some bubbles. Uh, you want me to cut this a little bit more? Oh, hold it. Oh. Oh, you need to be careful to don't cut your your fingers. It's okay. I have ten of them, so if I lose one, it's okay. Look here, please. So now that we have cut the uh, brown sugar, Fisa is going to show you how to, to actually do it. Alright. Okay. Show us. That just make it circle. Look at here. Okay, and then put the brown sugar inside. This is the filling, yeah? So chuck in here. When it's flawed, meat is ready. So how long do you reckon you need to wait? One minute. You want to try? Yeah. Again. I think it's enough now. It's okay. Okay, chuck in here. And just get another one more time. Finish it. I think that's enough. Another one more. It's good to go. Alright. Nice. Faster, faster. Take me back to those easy summer days when we stopped at nothing, babe. Yeah, we stopped at nothing, baby. They couldn't take us, they couldn't change us, they couldn't catch us. So, next week, we're going to teach you how to make random. What is random? 
Rendang is like a Malaysian traditional food. It's a main dish for normally when doing the festival. So we going to celebrate with that rendang. So I mean we cook almost for three hours. So we're gonna try to not make a three hours video for it but at least to show you how to make random. We made a video last year actually about it. Yeah, last year. Last year, but we're gonna renew it and explain to you maybe a little bit better how to make random. It's one of my favorite um, dish, and a random is the best. I know that Gordon Ramsay come to Malaysia like two or three years ago, I think. Yeah. Uh, I think he should come to try our random. He will love it. It's not crispy random. Crispy random. All right, is it ready? So we can see now that some of them is uh, floating, so they must be ready. Check. Yes. This is the last one. This is the last one, then we're done. <laughs> okay, so I want to wash my clothes. Makes me hungry to look at it. It's like fish bowl, you know? But with the fresh coconut, even better. Yeah, the fresh coconut better. Yeah. Because they run out of uh, coconut. Yeah, for sure. Okay. We'll put it in the plate. We just... Yeah, just gonna let it rest a little bit. It's hot, a little bit. Yes. And the rest not yet cooked. It actually doesn't take that much time to, to make. You know, no. Something that will take like 30 minutes. Something you can do with your kids. Yeah. Yeah, It'd be really nice can. for yeah. having fun with your kids. We're gonna finish this and we're gonna show it to you how it is inside. Going to take a bite afterwards? Of course. <laughs> Ooh, hot man. Oh boy, yeah. Spending time far away is never what I meant to do for us. When you make your own, I think it doesn't cost you much at all. No, of course. The ingredient is pretty cheap in Malaysia. Even though in Europe, I think it's okay, it's cheap. I'm not sure, but... Alright right, guys, so everything is uh, ready. And we're going to show you how it looks like inside. You take the first bite. No, we can keep it in there. Okay, we'll just sit here. Yeah. Yeah. Put some light here. Ah, 
them how it is and say it. Look. The brown sugar melt inside. Now this is called the Gula Malaka. Gula Malaka. That's really good. So, I remind you that we're gonna put the recipe on our website, so the links will be on the description below. And next week, we're going to teach you how to make render. So, do not miss this video. And if you have not subscribed yet, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and we will see you on the next video. Bye bye.